Welcome to the GEMDS video training series. In this video, I'll demonstrate how to modify the Orbit's static IP address. Let's use the web GUI to do this first. Log in as the admin user and navigate to the interface you wish to configure. This video will modify the bridge settings. Click Basic Config and then IPv4. Displayed here is the default static IP address that comes shipped with the unit. Click that address and a new settings box appears to the right. We can use this to update the current IP address in the system. Let's make mine 192.168.1.100. Click on update to overwrite the IP address configuration. Then click save to apply the changes. After we save the configuration, the IP address will be applied. Since we're using the web interface to manage the device, we need to navigate to the newly configured IP address to communicate with the orbit. Modify the navigation bar's IP address, press enter, and log in with the appropriate credentials. To configure IP addresses on the console, log in as admin and enter configuration mode by typing configure. To view the current IP address in the orbit, use the command show interfaces interface IPv4. This unit has the bridge IP address set to 192.168.1.100 with a prefix length of 24. The following command will modify the IP address. Rename interfaces interface bridge IPv4 address 192.168.1.100 192.168.1.100 this changes the IP address to 192.168.1.200. This can be verified using the same show command from before. A common error for the new Orbit user is to configure a new IP address with the set command, but forgetting to delete the default IP address afterwards. This rename command can be used to avoid that problem. Type the command commit to save and apply the configuration. I hope this video was helpful for you. For additional information, visit our website at www.gemds.com.